This is the commission I made so far. $59,000 in sales as a TikTok. $700 in less than two days. It took less than two hours for this AI generated faceless video to make 29,100 as a TikTok shop affiliate. And in this video, I'm gonna walk you through the five steps that you can follow to create a similar video so you can get started and potentially generate similar results. Now, what makes me sad is that most people are not gonna watch this video from beginning up until the end, meaning you're not gonna understand why it's important for each of these steps to follow each other. And you're probably not gonna get the bonus bit of information, which I'm also going to include which is going to make this process infinitely easier for you to replicate continuously but for everyone else come close but not too close and let's get started my name is victor and welcome to create bug where we help you create content ditch your 95 and live the life that you want it's one weird question from me i am a coffee man do you prefer coffee or do you prefer tea comment down below so i can check how many people are similar to me Okay, so as proof to my claims from earlier, this is the creator that I am talking about here and they are on Kalo Data, which is a really good data insights tool which tells you what creators are performing best currently on TikTok shop and how much money they are making as well as what shops, what products are selling best, what live streams are doing best and so forth. So it's really good if you are in the beginning stages of becoming a TikTok shop affiliate or starting a TikTok shop with the intention to sell for you to do product research and make informed decisions about what products are trending currently and what products are about to become popular as well as you'll see a bit later on in the video. So we can see that the creator is named Turbo Deals. They've got 2,400 followers. By the way, they're in the United States, but peep that they have become a TikTok shop affiliate and have been very successful with less than the 5,000 followers minimum requirement. I have created a video just earlier this week explaining how to go about becoming a TikTok shop affiliate in the United States and in the United Kingdom with less than the required follower requirements for essentially from zero followers. So you can go and check that video out to find out how they've done this. And there's a ton of creators that are TikTok shop affiliates from zero followers when TikTok is even allowing these people to go viral and make this much money. So, you know, um, yeah, it is working. This is the video that's in question. It's a 36 second long AI generated video. Um, if I click on it here. If a man took a 15 day gut cleanse every morning, this is what might happen to his body. There were no ads used in this video, as you can see here. This is the product that was being promoted, the 15 day cleanse. Further down, we can see that they generated 29,100 in just the last seven days there. They had 1.2 million views at the time of recording this video. They sold 1,500 of these 15 day gut and colon cleanse products from people clicking the basket in their videos and ordering these products. That's the total revenue they generated. Now, if you know TikTok shop affiliate, you'll know that generally these products go for about 20% commission. That's how much the creator would have gotten in their pockets. It could have been 30, it could have been 40%. So minimum, this faceless video will have earned this creator at least around $3,000 in just the last seven days. And that's take home. That's what goes in their pockets. I will link all these tools in the description, by the way. Um, so Kalo Data it is linked in the description if you want to try it out for yourself. So starting with step number one out of the five step process, how to find products that you can promote on TikTok shop as a TikTok shop affiliate. Now there's a number of different ways. There's a number of manual long ways to go about doing it. But the quickest way that I'm going to show you here on Kalo Data, what you do is if you go onto the video section, which now if you go onto the left hand side, um, you'll see revenue there. So if you click on revenue, it's actually, um, you can actually filter down your view to one to 10K. Now, currently, the reason why you're gonna be wanna, wanna do this is you're looking at for videos that got one to 10K in revenue in the last seven days or videos that have not sold too much. Videos that are not yet flooding the market. Because remember, if you're wanting to find a product, you don't want to find a product that's already flooded the market. You want to find a product that's about to flood the market. You don't wanna try and sell something that a lot of people will probably already have. So rather than 100, 1K to 100K, um, you wanna try and stick to 1K to 10K. What you also wanna do as well, just below that where it's got revenue, new trend if you click on that and um, currently it's on default if you change that to growing this shows you growing products 
And what I'm going to do now that I've selected those two filters, I'm going to go down at the bottom where it's got submit and click submit. And what you'll notice now is this little graph here, um, it's actually showing products that are going up rather than products that are going up and down. These lines here, they show you if a product is currently becoming more popular, if it's already been popular and it's on the decline like this one, or if it's generally up and down, or if it's on an upward trend. Like for example, this LED lighting mirror, we can see that it's only 9,900 is worth of revenue that's been sold so far by that video at least. Uh, 165 items sold and we can see they've had 217k views on it and we can also see that the trend is going upward so this tells you this is on its way to becoming more and more popular people are showing more and more interest in it and same thing here with this product here um, I don't know what this is some something to do with trousers women's trousers dress whatever and you can see they've sold 414 of them and they've sold under 10k's worth of revenue and it's going up so this tells you that people are becoming more and more interested and so forth so depending on the niche that you're in and what products you're interested in you can filter down by categories and you know electronic products health products makeup etc but these are the most popular quote-unquote products based on the parameters that you've put underneath revenue there. This tells you what's currently coming in and what's about to become popular as well as what's potentially on the decline. So this allows you to make decisions on finding products less from emotion but more from rational pragmatic data. Now in terms of generating their script, coming back to our video here, how do you go about doing that? So now there's Two ways that you can go about doing this one of them is a longer method and one of them is an easier method so we're going to start with the longer method first so the longer method is you go on to the product that you're going to promote so let's say now you've already found the product you know what product you're going to promote you take the name of that product like the name that you've got on here and you go on to either TikTok and search for the product there or you can go on to Google and search for that product in other marketplaces like I have done here. This is a random marketplace I don't generally use. Any decent looking marketplace that has ex that exact product, um, if you go into the description of that product, generally it'll give you the copy. It'll give you what the main benefits are of that product and what you can then do is copy all of that information here put it into an ai large language model tool the one that i'm using here is called gemini it was previously google bard and the reason why i absolutely love this tool is because it's connected to the internet and it's completely free it's by google so you know google is obviously the largest <laughs> search engine in the world so you know um it's uh, a tool that you can trust to give you the most up-to-date information a lot of people would say use chat gpt yes you can use chat gpt but you would need the paid version of chat gpt to be able to browse the internet and find you up-to-date information some of these products may have not been around in 2021 which is how far the free version of chat gpt can only go so what I've done here, as you can see, I've put that copy that I've found from the marketplace um, into Gemini here. And what I've done is I have asked it to list five benefits of using this product in simple language that an eight year old can understand in a humorous tone. And I've copied the name of the product there. And what it's done is bring me uh, show me those five benefits here now this is very important because these are the benefits that i'm going to mention in my videos it's not the full script yet um, i can take this further i can ask chat i can ask you know chat gpt if you're using that or i can ask gemini to generate me a tiktok script based on these five benefits with a hook with a body and with a call to action as well now this is a really good method of doing it but the problem is this script that i'm generating here is not necessarily this script which we know for a fact generated nearly thirty thousand dollars in under seven days so so that being said the quicker method to do this is again if you've got kalo data which i have got linked in the description you can actually ask it to download the video script for you as you can see at the top there so you're essentially downloading a thirty thousand dollar video script from the tiktok video that has been generated by this creator Let's click download video script and um, it's gonna re-download it here just for the purpose of showing you guys. That's the video script. Now you can then take this even further and ask the AI within Kalo Data to break this script down for you into a hook, 
into a body and into a call to action using exactly these words that the creator has done here so i'm going to do that here just to show you guys here we go so if we say please break this script down into a hook body and call to action so you're now taking the script used by the creator and you're breaking that down into a hook the body of the script and the call to action that's going to ask people to click the link or click the basket and purchase the product and here we go the ai is now analyzing that script and it's now breaking it down for you so this is good for a number of reasons a it allows you to not exactly carbon copy the script off that creator as it is yes you're using the same words yes you're using the same benefits yes you're using the same inspiration but you're not necessarily jumping in and saying the exact same thing that they're saying from beginning all the way up until the end now that the ai has generated you this script you can just copy it put it into your google document you can put it into your note pad on your phone or whatever you can write it down you can use it as it is or again you can maybe twist it and try and make it your own either way you've got a thirty thousand dollar video script right there and this in my opinion is the quickest way and the most accurate way because you're using a script that has been proven to generate money the third step in the process which is finding ai images so by now i've played the video and you guys have seen the video if a man took a 15 day gut cleanse every morning this is what might happen to his body on the first day five pounds of dookie would come out of his body and he so now we're going to want to try and generate those images that we've seen and there's various tools that can help us do this now i've got a list in the description and i'm going to show you here free tools and some of my favorite paid tools as well because you want to remember that you know free tools are great but there's a sea of people that are also using the exact same free tools so if you're someone that's serious and you want to stand out maybe you might want to think about considering paid tools because a lot of people will not do that so it's up to you if you want to be one amongst the sea of people that are using the exact same tools get an exact same result or if you want to be rather on the smaller pond of people that are using the more paid more advanced tools you can do that as well that's entirely up to you personally i prefer to try and dip my toes into the paid tools because they tend to generate higher quality results so the first one that i would recommend is called mid journey this is an old favorite of mine it's very popular i'm not going to go into too much detail about mid journey the internet is awash with videos that tell you how to use this tool so if i go into my as you can see it's something that i use myself some of the thumbnails recently that i've been using on this channel have come from mid journey and i've been using it for a very long time there's a lot of images that i've created of here and the quality from mid journey is just absolutely insane now the craziest thing that it can also do in upload images from other creators for inspiration so for example if i'd gone on to this video i'm able to somehow get the images that the creator has provided in this video or used in this video and download them and put them onto my desktop i can upload them onto mid journey and allow ask mid journey to describe the prompt of how that image came about so you can upload for example a youtube thumbnail download it and upload it onto mid journey and it's actually going to describe that image for you so you can use that exact same prompt to generate a similar image the beautiful thing about it is it's not going to generate the exact same image that you've taken from someone else but it generate a similar result not exactly the same one so you can keep it unique keep it your own while you're using something that someone else has used um, successfully so that is one of my pound for pound favorite tools mid journey i will link it in the description another one i will shout out is lexica.art again not too different from mid journey except you don't need to go into discord to generate images here you can just generate them on the website you just go onto the generate tab and you can start generating images from there as well and again the quality when it comes to lexica is absolutely insane a lot of these tools will have free trials that you can use by the way so definitely go and check them out another one also i would recommend again i've not really used this one it's leonardo.ai so you can go and check that one out as well as you can see really really good quality there's a bunch of free 
AI image generating tools that you can explore online, but these are just a few that I'm mentioning in this video, all of which will be linked in the description. So that covers how these image generations came about that are in this video. Another quick thing I want to mention as well is a lot of the time with this AI generated videos on TikTok shop, TikTok will be looking for the product. So as much as you can create the AI generated images and as much as you can get away with it initially, you will need to have at some point during the video, a picture or a video of the actual product that you are promoting. What people tend to do is maybe copy or clip one of the videos that are already existing on TikTok that show someone's hand maybe opening the product or picking up the product, something along those lines, just a split second or two showing the actual product, then the TikTok AI is not going to flag your video as being a violation. Because if you promote products without showing the actual product in the video, there's a chance that it could be flagged as a violation, which is not good. But you need to try and have it somewhere in there. And before I forget, I'm going to shout out CapCut as well, because they do also have a new free tool that you can use to generate images. So also check out CapCut's text to image generator as well. In terms of creating the AI voice tool that I would recommend is called 11 labs. It's very popular. Again, I'm not going to go too in depth in terms of creating videos where I'm creating AI voices with 11 labs, but it is pound for pound. One of the best, if not the best AI generation tools out there, I will link it in the description and in terms of the paid side of things. Now, in terms of tools that you can use that are free, um, I would just advise you to go into Google. There's a bunch, there's a sea of free AI tools that you can consider using. So do the research and see what other options are available for AI voices. But the one that I would personally go with, and they do have a free trial as well, is 11 Labs for the highest possible quality. And a lot of the videos that you're hearing and seeing generally have used 11 labs in one form or another. The tool is so good that it's been actually connected to other AI video generation platforms in the back end. So they use this tool as well, like nvideo.ai, you might have heard of it, like pictory.ai, you might have heard of that as well. They actually use this tool in the back end to generate their voices, but really good. Definitely one I'd recommend. As you can see, I've used it a bunch of times myself as well. Now, in terms of putting it all together, so you've now got the AI voice, you've now got the AI images, and you've now got a script that you can use that you've either generated yourself or you've downloaded directly from Kalo Data. So you've more or less got the tools that you need or the assets that you need to create a TikTok AI generated video like this one. So at this point, I would recommend bringing everything together into CapCut completely free tool again there are a bunch of other video editors that you can use out there you know you use the one that you are more comfortable with and that is your favorite but for me i would consider strongly using CapCut. you can use it on desktop you can use it on mobile and what you'd be doing without going into too much detail again is downloading your ai voice that you've gotten from 11 labs or a similar tool it'll come out as an audio file so you drag that onto here the images that you've made on lexica um, mid journey or Leonardo, you'd also be copying and downloading those and putting them on the timeline here. And you can do lots of wonderful things, transitions, just some basic edits, just to make it interesting here. You can also include text that is on the screen, as you can see here, and um, that's also within CapCut. So you can also do that. And essentially this is where you can put the video together and just put this simple edit on there. What people generally tend to do is have an image for every sentence to try and make it dynamic, keep it moving, keep it interesting, and just add some transitions, even if there's a similar transition all throughout the video. Now, in terms of the music, you can either add it on CapCut here with, or you can add it within TikTok. And the crazy thing is, again, Kalo Data will show you what song was used within the video, what sound was used within the video. As we can see here, it's saying original sound, which means they did not add a sound within TikTok on the video. But if they had added a sound, you would see the exact sound that this creator used. I would urge you to use exactly the same sound as well. So personally, I would not add any music on here. I'd wait until it's time to publish the video within TikTok and then either add the sound that was used or keep it without a sound on here. And now you should have um, a full AI generated video that you have edited and done here within TikTok. And again, with me talking in this video, it probably sounds long, but with you having done this once, twice, a bunch of times, you're probably gonna be able to get through all these five different stages within 
a period of an hour, maybe two hours. And you might have other similar images that you've generated in the past as well. So you might not even need to prompt those images out of AI in order to create those videos. For those of you that I've watched up until now, um, the bonus point that I wanted to mention and I just wanted to shout out as well is now that you have a fully fledged AI video that you're ready to publish onto TikTok, the crazy thing about Kalo Data is it actually gives you the hashtags that you can include as well. So you've got your hashtags already there, you literally just copy them and put them into your TikTok description. You can also click onto the creator's username which is going to take you onto TikTok. Um, so let me just do that here. And now the TikTok profile of that creator is gonna load. And the crazy thing is you can see that video already that's generated them that much money. It's that one there that's got 1.6 million views. Now, the crazy thing about this is you can actually copy the description of the video. So I've just paused the video. If you go to the top there, you will see what the description of the video is here on desktop. You can do the same thing on mobile as well. So not only have you got the hashtags that they've used, not only have you got the sound that they've used, but you have also got the description of the video. They've not even got a description here. All they've put is be careful with these exclamation mark. And they've put the three different hashtags that you can see here on Kalo data. And that's it. Description is non-existent pretty much, but they've still been able to make that much money. So with a tool like this, you're essentially 60, 70% of the way there already with the information that you've got here. And the key, key thing, the powerful thing about Kalo Data is you are using from a video that has already generated the income that you want to generate.